I'm back from a bit of a break. Like, same day break. Hoping it would help a bit. Whoops. Sorry if I'm, uh, worse than normal at this. I don't know. I'm not, like, snapping out of it. Like, I feel foggy today. And, uh, I thought maybe it's like, ah, oh, it's just the beginning of the session, or, oh, the coffee hasn't set in yet, which is what I said a couple episodes ago. But, uh, I don't know. It's gonna be one of those days, I suppose. At the same time, though, like, I kinda gotta go. <laughs> Cause, uh, I've taken three days off this week, technically. I had a week, I had a day off early this week where I was like, hey, there's gonna be no Outer Wilds for a few days, cause I was supposed to record that today, but, uh, my sleeping schedule's fucked up, so I'm gonna try to fix that today. Which is the day I also did that, like, I did that Death Stranding stream, uh, instead. Where I was all, all low energy and shit, because I was like, I don't know, I can't do my schedule today, but I kind of want to just do something. <sighs> then, like, the, like, a day or two later, I think, there was the threat that they were going to, like, turn off the power to parts of California because of high winds and stuff like that, or there might be power outages as a result. So I'm like, ah, shit. And I was like, should I record stuff today, or should I just fuck off? Because I didn't want to deal with the idea of losing a recording because of the power outage. And I looked up and my light flickered. I'm like, okay, that's a sign. I guess I won't record today. So I just hung out and streamed uh, Overwatch all day. Uh, instead of doing anything on my schedule. And then yesterday, uh, there was just kind of a spontaneous thing with the housemates. They're like, hey, you want to go out and get lunch? Hey, you want to watch these Harry Potter movies? And said before long, the entire day was gone. So I basically had three days off. So it's like, I really got to... I really gotta get some Shovel Knight done today, but at the same time, I'm just like, I don't know, this, like, fogginess I woke up with isn't going away all day, so I just gotta live with that at some point. I don't know. I've been here before where, like, you fall into a spiral of, like, I don't know, I don't feel quite right for work, maybe I won't work today, but then you could fall, in, but then you, you, could, you could keep, like, not feeling that way every day. So you kind of need to, like, power through it, because for all you know, you might not feel ready for work every day for a week, or weeks, or whatever. And that's how you, like, prob potentially, like, maybe fall into a depression or whatever, and you, just, you lose your, 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 like, your thing that was making it all work or whatever. I don't know. It's a weird thing. Sometimes what's nice about co-commentary, doing it with a second person, is that, like, people, like, mediate each other's moods, and kind of, like, calibrate each other. I've had weird days where, like, I feel funky, but then I just do, like, stuff with, like, Andrew or someone, or Stephanie, and, like, I sort of, like, rebalance myself, and, like, it's like I just get over it. It's weird. Uh, there was kind of an instance of that where I started that Death Stranding stream, and I was just, like, out of it and dead, and I was just like, oh, look at my boring Death Stranding post-game stuff. Today's a wash. But then, like... Effie and Andrew joined the chat, and over the course of a few hours, I was just kind of like, all animated and kind of normal again, despite everything. So, I don't know. Blah, 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 blah. Anyway, let's try to kill this asshole again. I'm gonna be so zen and calm, even though I went for a walk, and I got the mail, and I took a shower, and just did stuff that would hopefully, like, reset my mind, and both chill from the stress of doing this boss fight, and also, just sort of try to get over with today's weird funk. But... I don't feel any different. <laughs> uh, oh god. It's just stressful. <laughs> Platformers are stressful. Come here. Wow, he just let me combo him for a while. Oh, shit. This has been unusually long. A lot of that's the Joustus, but I think it's also the three-phase overworld with lots of secrets and branching paths. Uh, I think the King Knight campaign is as long as two other campaigns combined. It might even go as long as being as long... By the end of this, it might even be as long as, like, Fuck me! God damn it, fuck. All that work. I'm not sure what the final episode count's gonna be like, but it actually might be as long as, like, doing the entire other three campaigns combined. Like, it's... It's so long that it might be 50% of the overall Shovel Knight content, which is kind of nuts. 
But some of that is the inflation from my performance not being amazing, but also, uh, oopsie, uh, but also the fact that the card game takes up a lot of time. Oh, the heart! And also the fact that the, uh, oh god, no. And also the fact that me let's playing the card game makes it take longer than it normally would if somebody was just not saying anything and just kind of doing actions. I don't know. Wow, this attempt's way- I don't- I don't know why some attempts go so well and some- some go so poorly. I don't feel like I'm approaching the fight that differently. But it's just- it's just so much. It's like so mentally taxing to fucking fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just not- I'm not getting into a groove today at all. I'm just not. There's no groove. Heart. No. No. <sighs> I hit my head on the missile. Hit my head on the missile, so I just fell in the hole. And hit. And this guy's recovery is garbage. So when you fall in a hole, it's like you're fucking little Mac, and you're just incapable of recovering from the fact. So I dash into the wall, and you just see my idiot little spin cap, like, f come flying out of the top of the area. But he doesn't- he doesn't clear the ledge, so the recovery is useless, so he just dies. It's one of those stressful moments where I'm just like, I don't know what's about to happen to me. I'm just everywhere, and the platforms are changing and moving. And, like, I just... Eh. Hell, half the time you attack this guy, you leave the screen and can't tell where you are anymore. It's kind of stressful when there's moving instant death platforms everywhere on the floor. What? No, don't add new attacks. Fuck you. Oh, thank god. Oh. Rescue me. Bloom, 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 bloom. Sure, let's just go straight into another boss fight. <laughs> I won't regret this at all. There's a lot of boss fights in this game. I just broke your front door because I'm a dick. <gasps> spin wolves! He can't be that bad, he's the god of spin wolves. We're close friends. Fresh meat soon. Then it's time to see if this journey has been worth it. Is that the sound of a... Of, is that what... Is that the sound of a spin wolf's howl? It's adorable. You there! Are those your dogs? I love dogs, but shouldn't they be on a leash? These are Spin Wolves, friend, and only a raving fool would disrespect them. Exactly. Ooh, cute, and yet fearsome. They are trained for combat, I presume. Hm. We train each other. You seem sturdy. How about I give you a little demonstration? Oh my god, give me an entire campaign of Polar Knight, where he has Spin Wolves that you get to use in combat. Oh my god. Oh god, every single spin wolf is itself. Uh, 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 oh god, the entire screen is covered in damage. Help me. Help me. <laughs> Why did that hurt hit it? Did I beat all the spin wolves? <sighs> oh god, right, the lot that's happening. I can't get the heart. <laughs> no! 
It's too much! Ah, no, these will instantly kill you, what the fuck? What the fuck, man? Fuck you. This is bullshit, you're covering the entire level with instant death shit. This isn't fucking fair. Jesus Christ! <laughs> I remember him doing this, but I don't remember going so fast. He just completely covered the screen. Oh, I won. How did I win? What? Fuck it. Whatever. <laughs> I, l <laughs> I just flail at these boss fights. Like, I just am like, ah, attack over there, jump over there, what's happening? And then I win, and I'm like, I don't even know what happened. These are the most chaotic 2D boss fights I've, like, ever played. They're, they're often so much more chill. Glam me up, motherfucker. What? The gold plating for the glide wing. You can upgrade things again? Let's, dis let's do an overhaul of my display. Damn. Look at all that shit. Look how hype that top bar just got. Does it change again? How oh, drab. So you can, you can revert it and that's it. Hmm. Oh yeah, you, all you little shits join my crew each time. When I left, men of tin swept through the halls of my proud home. I planned to build parts of their scraps. But first, I have to play a match or two. Oh, the holes are back. rough. Kind of have to just throw away cards because the whole level's covered in gems and holes. Shit's kind of weird, yo. What? That is a conveyor. How do you have two directions of conveyor at the same time? How does it choose which direction to conveyor? There's still a lot of mechanics I just don't understand about this game, I guess. They've been, like, kind of half-explained. In the hole with you- oh. Never mind. What? So which direction is he gonna go next? Because he just went that way. Will he go down or right? Like, how, what? How, how does this rule work? I don't... I don't... I don't know! I don't know how it works! How do you know? Let's throw him in a hole, so fuck it. Yes, I would like gems. How did you know? It didn't switch direction? Why didn't you switch direction? He's just gonna push me left into the hole though. I mean, he's just gonna leave that platform on his own next turn, so... I guess I should just resign to that.
I can push him out of the way, but I can't push him out of the way that stop in a way that stops him from just pushing me left into the hole and then taking it for himself. Shit's kind of fucked, yo. This will let him push on his own, though, automatically. Wait, that was confused. Okay, I guess that's also an option. Now I just gotta slide in there and make sure you don't get to take the gem from me. So, ha. Huh. Now it's trapped. You can't get in there. So now I win, I think. I don't think you can do anything about this, right? Let's fill this board. Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it, buddy. Come on. Why, why, what was the point of that? Are you making a play, you son of a bitch? Are you making a play? He only has left arrows, though, so he can't claim either of those gems. I don't think he has a play. I think he's just putting shit places. I think he's just putting shit places. <laughs> I think I win? Yeah. Yes. 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 Mine. It's all mine. I win. My win. Hmm. Yeah, all of their, uh, I think all of their movement arrows are based on the movement of the particular creature pretty consistently. Now that the now that the arrows are getting more expressive and varied, you're starting to really see the the idea of that more. Hmm. Add one to the deck, I guess. <laughs> I will now leave and come back. Why hello other knight. I told them not to leave my spinwolves alone in the hold. Their breath will melt the hole. Alright, oh, because they can shoot lava. But there's also spin wolves just hanging out up there. How do you tell which ones? I mean, I guess you know which ones are yours. We may play jobs just, but I will miss their keen senses. Everyone just is hanging out and joining. Whoa! It's based on his boss arena. His boss arena, the whole floor is covered in death and it's ultra wide. So, so is the board. This board doesn't have a graveyard. Or maybe the bottom's the graveyard. It might be the bottom. Mm-hmm. Rude. Not much getting around that. Yeah, the bottom's the graveyard. So you can push stuff into there, but you can't get in there on your own. Roro. You could just go away. I want this tile for myself. What are you doing? Rude. Shit. They're my plan. My master plan! It's gone! But how's anyone gonna get in that tile now? You can't push that one left, you can't push that one right, you can't push that one down. Is it gonna be a- Is this round gonna be a draw? I can't... Oh, you can push this entire row over. That's useful for me getting my gem. No! 
My only down arrow is a team switcher. Wait, no, but if I just play it anywhere else, like here, the team switch won't matter. And now he has to push mine down, potentially? Yeah, he has to make me win, like in one of those puzzles. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Of course I want Shovel Knight. Uh, shovel Polar Knight, right? I gotta remember that the game's called Shovel Knight because there's a different Shovel Knight. He's the super Shovel Knight. He's, he's differently shovely, differently knight. <laughs> Uh, your, your, your time has, has ended, Black Knight. We, we played, we used you at the beginning of the game, and we're beyond you now. He's one of the, he's one of the Joustus, like, champion characters, so you want to keep him around all game. Uh, out of, like, some sense of solidarity of that. Like, look, I've got all the Elite Four in my deck, but... The game is fundamentally balanced around surpassing him permanently. Kind of unavoidably. Ta-da! Got me some medals for days. I think that's everybody. Yep. Now it's back to rotating through a huge number of people for that part of the screen. 90 merit medals? You're quickly becoming a bard in your own right. No, Shit. I'm sorry. There's little rhymes, but... I was trying to skip through the several pages of repeating text to get to the new part, and I slightly misclicked. Oh well. If you pause at the right moment, you'll be able to read it. It was on the screen for a second there. That's a bummer. But also so is 80% of text being the same stuff you read before. It's time for Propeller Night, my favorite anxiety causer. Are you just not gonna... Do I not buy any more items in this dungeon, or what? I guess I'll go buy some more pool. I think I, I think she can still make the pie. The game trained me to save up for the tiles where you buy a new ability, but I think we're done with that. Pride bore such a noble countenance, don't you agree, my sweet prince? Ah, but it's nothing about your graceful features, my lady. Would you please stop speaking to my mother? Ta-da! I've got ten more. Next one's gonna be eight. Which is only one more, actually, from now. I guess the idea is, yeah... Come to think of it, this screen is, like, full, so I guess I have every heirloom, so I guess we're done with those levels. So I guess it's time to just buy the pies now. Alright, time to go work on this side of the screen. Flying machine. Hello, sad beetle. Oh! Ow. Ah! They explode? Jesus. I'm so used to that kind of thing being at the platform you can use. Okay. Not exactly a safe context to learn what the walls and items mean, is it? <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's just actively killing me. Egoraptor would not be happy. This doesn't follow the Mega Man 8 rules at all. Or Mega Man X, fuck. Jesus Christ, this first room? What happened to the whole thing where you learn about the functionality of how a monster and or a device works in a safe context and then... and then you get to deal with it in a scarier room? Okay, come on. I legit am, like, actually concerned. Like, how do I beat this room? Like... 
How do I get to the ladder? Fuck! <laughs> uh. Oh, you can't. Oh, it's. God damn it. You can bounce on them and hit them. It was bad feedback. Right, because it breaks when it hits the wall, but that's when I hit it. So it looked like it broke when I hit it. Did these break when I hit them? No. Yeah, so that was just bad feedback. But I, I dash it to try to solve the level, and then it breaks, so I'm like, what? I break the cannonballs? That's kind of... You're fucked if that's the case. What? Why? 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 That's... okay. <laughs> That's not how those work. That's just a dick move game. You're supposed to bounce off those and then eat the thing inside of them. Isn't that- isn't that the case? I think that's the case. I don't remember. I don't think I'm making that up. I'm pretty sure- I think you bounce off of dinner plates. I forgot what they're called. The covered- the, the covered dinner plate thing has a word for it, I think. I can't remember what that is. But I think you bounce off those when you hit them, not just fly through them off a cliff. My money! I'm trying to beat this game. I don't like this music either, which isn't helping. I like this better, but that, that intro part where it's doing the weird whatever, I don't even know what to call that. It's like trying to emulate electronic music, but like because there's so little it just sounds like it's glitching out. It doesn't sound great. <laughs> So don't, I don't like the uh, the intro sound when I, every time I respawn. But this is fine, once it transitions out of that. Uh. Soul's gonna come out of my body. I, I just. <laughs> uh,
I just, I, I just fucking, I'm melting. I don't know what to say. Like, I can't... <laughs> I'm dying in every possible place? <laughs> and like, maybe I need a vacation, I don't know. Or maybe it's just because I'm bad at platformers and this level's completely covered in death holes. Like, you just instantly die every time you make a mistake. I... <laughs> uh... I'm just... I don't wanna... I don't know, I'm just staring at it. I'm like, I don't... I kind of don't want to keep going. But like, it's not because the game's bad. I'm just exhausted by playing it? <laughs> or something? Or maybe this is just a bad week for me. I don't know. Tell you what. Fucking crazy controversial choice. I'm gonna air... That's an idea. I'm gonna air her story. It's eight episodes long. Uh... Because I already have that recorded. And then we'll come back to this when I'm done from that. I'll take a little fucking vacation from dying so much in this game. I'll see you guys in a week. We'll try Shovel Knight again, see if I'm in a better fucking emotional state for this kind of platforming. Because... <laughs> uh, I don't want to do any more today. But I gotta... I gotta... air something. But hey, you know, I already record the next indie game. It's her story, so I'm gonna air that. See you guys in a week. Sorry if you're disappointed. I'm- but I'm falling apart, clearly, and should take a break.